hello guys in this video i'll be showing you how to fix launch error please close interception before starting the game so actually i just closed my pc and went to sleep in the next day i opened up my pc and trying to launch the game and i saw this error message now these fixes works for steam epic games and other launchers it also works for any game such as rust dead by daylight fortnite or any other game that uses EAC which stands for easy anti-cheat I will show you three solutions most probably the third solution must fix your issue so let's get started for the first solution just exit the game press ctrl plus shift plus escape key to open up the task manager go to your launcher and end your launcher's task after that launch your launcher again and try launching the game again okay if the error proceeds to pop up let's try the second solution so the second solution is to just exit the game and make sure that you are not opening any program that runs in the background such as msi afterburner or any other program make sure to close them and try launching the game again now for the third solution which it's worked for me just go to google and search for interception.exe and enter the first link which is from github after that go to the releases and press on the latest then press on the interception.zip and choose where you want to save it i will save it in this folder that i just created all right now close the browser and go to the zip folder that you have just downloaded right click and press on extract here after that go into the folder go to command line installer and we need this file right click and cut it now go back to the main folder and paste it over here now just delete those two folders we don't need them all right now open up the command prompt by searching cmd but make sure to run it as administrator all right after that just click on the path bar of the folder and select the whole path copy it now go back to cmd and type in cd space and paste the path up here now press on enter and make sure you are in the right folder by typing dir and press enter and yeah right here you see the file then type in install and press on tab after that press on space then press on slash and type in uninstall then press on enter all right it says that it was successfully uninstalled and we must reboot our device for this to take effect and actually before that i will show you what files will be deleted after rebooting your pc just go to your pc and your local disk then go to windows then head to system 32 after that go to drivers then search for keyboard.sys so this process will delete the keyboard.sys and the mouse.sys all right let me reboot my pc and test the game all right guys i'm back let me try to search for keyboard.sys it sounds like it is invalid and let me try for mouse it's also invalid so it deleted them successfully and don't forget guys you can delete this file you don't need it anymore now let me try launching the game and yep it sounds like it is working and yep we have successfully solved the issue all right guys don't forget to like and subscribe if you got benefit from the video and to watch my other tutorial videos and in the time being peace out